All right, welcome back everybody. Uh, quick video, actually gonna answer a question. Uh, had a guy ask on Blazer Tactical 2, and it was just easier to do a video on it. Uh, somebody wanted to know about where to get a monopod for these guns. I don't know if even the, I don't know if the, the light's even good, if you can even see this. So, uh, as anyone who's in the Blazer game knows, the, uh, the um, uh, parts on Blazers are expensive. And then not only are they expensive, they're hard to come by. So a very enterprising person that uh, I had met a while back, instead of um, buying a Blazer monopod because he couldn't find one, he had some uh, he had some made. So and I'm sure this would work for a lot of different a lot of different ones. So uh, monopod rear rear butt spike, however you want to call it, um, you do can do your uh, gross adjustments, and then you can do fine adjustments. So, if you can see that on film, probably not, but what the hell. So, let's go ahead and show this real quick. Let's have to take those that come out. Under the, my understanding is from the person that had these made, he had a batch of them made, that none of this is, um, none of this is, uh, is custom. It's uh, a standard bar stock size. So, uh, he took a piece of bar stock, uh, probably bought one piece, and had it cut for um, say five different five different um, five different uh, uh, pieces, and then had each end threaded, and then cut a recess into the uh, bar stock, and then apparently this is this foot, um, it's aluminum, uh, just aluminum piece is something you can buy from I guess any hardware supply store, so that threads into the. Um, threads into the uh, the monopod directly so that's your fine adjustment and also just so happens this particular piece is just wide just just thin enough that it will fit up into the uh, the the hole in, in the uh, in the back of the stock to um, to hold it in place and then this this secures it and this was also a standard piece that you could get from uh, uh, I think a, a hardware supply shop so I'm gonna go ahead and let's give some quick if I can do this on film, I literally have a meeting here at the armory in probably less than five minutes. So this comes out to 0 0.308. Let's try that again. Well, let's zero it. 0 0.310. And we'll do it in millimeters. My battery's about to die for those maybe that want it. It comes out to 7.96 millimeters. So the bar stock is 7.96 millimeters. Let's do the rear foot first in English. The, uh, the critical part's gonna be the, uh, the recess. Let's go ahead and measure that out. I've never measured this before. That works out to 0.616 inches, 0.616. We'll do it in millimeters and zero for those that are curious. And we are at 15.66 millimeters. And as, as for the uh, threads per inch or the, the thread count, um, I have no idea. That's going to be up to you to, to pair that up with your foot. And but you'll probably need to match the uh, the thread on on the receiver. This stock is 4.8 millimeters wide, and in inches it works out to 0.19 point point. 189 inches so figure out the thread pitch and that is all you need to make a butt spike or monopod for a blazer tactical tactical 2 or lrs2 if you want to see more pictures of this gun in use uh, or have any questions uh, just leave a comment in, on our website john1911.com that's j-o-h-n-1911.com Remember, it's all about shooting guns and having fun. Everybody, have a good day.